Your Majesty is calling for the Master Curian. Uh, Master Curian is ever so gracious as to record these events for posterity, and he would just like to explain where the cameras will be for people so that there's no confusion. <laughs> we'll pretty much be on the, the, the corners nearest the, uh, nearest the throne on the outside. They're going to get blocked at some point, but we do the best we can, and it takes a while, but we will get you all of your bouts, as well as one great big tourney movie of the entire tournament, once we're done. Well, there, there was one other thing. And, and what would that be? Your Majesty's... I would beg a boon! within our power. It shall be yours. Your Majesties, for her more than three decades in service and practice of the Bardic Arts. No. <laughs> <laughs> for keeping the Bardic flame alive when our days were darkest and we could not gather to sing. Huzzah. I ask that you elevate my friend, Hilla Stormbringer, to your most noble order of the laurel. Summon forth the order. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, yeah. Surprise. Sorry. Here we go. Laurel. Laurel. Ah, that was what I was going to say. It was. Summon the order of our Laurel. <laughs> Their Majesty's gone before them. Their noble order, order of the Laurel. <laughs> Masters and mistresses of the Laurel, is it your judgment that Hilla is worthy to join your order? Aye! <laughs> it is the opinion of these your peers that you have shown greater qualities in service of the Laurel in service to the arts and science <clears> than <throat> you a member of the most noble of the Therefore, we here charge you to stand your place. Think well on your deeds and work, present yourself, or of work, as time you be offered elevation.